So even more FUD, even more FUD with the Terra Luna airdrop, it doesn't stop here. And it definitely does affect the price. So Terra Luna airdrop unevenly distributed another failed plan potentially. The Terraform Labs is doing everything to remove themselves from murky waters and ease Terra Luna 2.0's uh, price performance. The ghost of Luna Classic is still haunting their backs after USD and Luna Classic fell to zero. A lot of people that saw this started selling fast. The team had planned to airdrop Luna tokens to affected holders during 2.0 launch. So they decided to release an airdrop. If you want more content like this, be sure to smash that like button. The Terra Air Luna airdrop has not gone according to plan and distribution affected users has been uneven. Several Luna investors took to social media airing their problems are not full receiving their promised airdrop distributions. A lot of people are very mad because they wanted to sell at least some Terra Luna they, they previously lost because Terra Luna went from $30 to $3. Many users received comparatively fewer tokens via airdrop that doesn't stand true to the promised compensation by the team. The Terra team confirmed they're fully aware of the situation and will complete the airdrop rightly soon. And again, I think this uh, this contract was written very fast because they wanted to launch the airdrop as soon as possible. Um, they didn't give a tentative date. I think this will be solved. I think the people that deserve their airdrop, you know, basically deserve that, uh, basically deserve their, their tokens and they will get them or at least that's how uh, the team feels like. Um, and that is pretty, pretty crazy right now. With what's happening with Terra Luna, the, the fiasco just doesn't stop. Tension Luna airdrop recipients were aware that some have received less Luna from the airdrop than expected and are actively working on the solution. More information will be provided and we gather all the data, so stay tuned, they tweeted. We'll have to wait and watch for official confirmation by the Terra team when the issue is sorted. So that's a, that's another thing to, to actually worry about. But... Uh, really really important terra 2.0 is also going to be launching a stable coin and a lot of people aren't happy with that a lot of people are, ha are not happy they did not receive their airdrops and they should rightfully so and more information will be provided so anyone that did not receive their airdrops yet uh stay on the line by liking and subscribing i'll keep you updated with more news about the terra team uh but terra should launch their stable coin as well the terra form labs is going to be working on a stable coin um, I'll keep you guys that updated with that as well. The development is not yet confirmed by the team, and Quan has mostly remained silent about launching yet another stablecoin. But there is rumors about this, and if this happens, I think a lot of people are going to be seriously, seriously negative about stablecoins. Um, there's a very, very mixed opinion, and it's mostly negative on what should be next. Should stablecoins even launch at this point? I don't think so. I think people want Terra Luna 2.0 uh, to launch. I know he's been saying that he wants to launch a back stable coin. I mean, that could be just a rumor again, guys. But he wants to actually focus on Terra Luna 2.0 development and bring value to holders. But what do you guys think about this? What do you think about the Terra Luna 2.0 fiasco? The development is not confirmed. And Quan mostly remained silent by launching yet another stable coin. And what do you guys think will happen? Even Luna, 2. Uh, even Luna could be the culprit to a big 2 million loss. If you want more content like this, I'll keep you guys updated with more news. Peace, everyone.